the think tanks in India, some of them are coming in under extreme scrutiny, which are critical of the Modi government. I totally, totally disagree with it. The Modi government enjoys a huge political majority in this country. Think tanks, on the other hand, are a very small ecosystem. Why would a government, which is so popular, waste its time to try and muzzle the think tanks? Because even if they do, the impact of this is going to be marginal to negligible. What do you have to say about the George Soros uh, funding that is coming into several think tanks around the world? Any entity that it needs to uh, function needs money and needs resources to be able to do that. India Foundation is a RSS affiliated think tank. It does not take any funding from uh, foreign entities. In our view, we consider it uh, unethical. You can't take money and say I'm taking money for polio eradication and then start funding Naxalite movement. From the left side, there is a kind of an intellectual snobbery uh, when they term you people on the right wing as that it's a weak intellectual bent strength. Our left hai, which suffers from a deep syndrome of colonialism. When the Prime Minister goes and talks about self-pride, these people think that, oh, it's exaggeration. What they don't realize, that it is that self-pride that allows the common citizen of India to start doing things that they otherwise believed they could never do. <laughs>